The Battle of Yukoko took place on 21 September 1914 during the Komayun campaign of the First World War between French and German troops in Yukoko, Komayun or modern-day Koko Beach, Gabon. Chapter 1 – Background Following the invasion of Komayun after the outbreak of war between Germany and the Allies, the main military objective of France and Britain was to seize control of the colony's coast to ensure that additional men and supplies could not reach the German forces there. By mid-September 1914, British and French naval vessels had effectively blockaded the Wuri estuary and the main port of Douala. On 21 September, the French gunboat, Surprise which had escorted French soldiers from Libreville, appeared before the village of Yukoko in southern New Cameron. This town had a small German garrison, and French forces wished to occupy it. The French vessel shelled the town and destroyed much of it. Chapter 2 – Landings and Battle Following the shelling, four boats carrying French soldiers and machine guns were launched from the Surprise in an attempt to take Yukoko. The small force, under the command of Colonel Mikulad, landed on the beach but encountered fire from German units who had entrenched themselves on higher ground. Later in the afternoon, nine more boatloads of French soldiers arrived on the beach and advanced up it. The Germans now came under heavy fire from the machine guns brought from the surprise. Many of the new German recruits fled. At three o'clock in the afternoon, the French launched a major assault on the German positions. The resistance of German forces deteriorated, and they eventually retreated. During the battle, the Germans made attempts to attack the French gunboat, Surprise, which was situated in Carisco Bay. The steamer Itolo and armed launch Chaos were both sunk in attacks against the French ship. Chapter 3 Aftermath Following the battle, the column under the command of Mikulad would push eastward along the southern border of Spanish Guinea. The German force that had once occupied Yukoko retreated to Mbini in the neutral Spanish colony of Rio Muni to the north. This practice would be followed throughout the rest of the campaign where German units would escape to the Spanish colony and surrender there. The action at Yukoko, along with the landings that took place at Bola secured the coast of Comayun for the Allies and greatly restricted the movements of German forces.